Hello friends, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Um, it is Monday morning and we are doing a week in the life. Gotta get my rings out of my purse to put on because they are my identifiers in life. This one says I'm married to Jacob and this one says I'm a Clemson grad. So, very important things. I'm gonna take my medicine real quick. Comment down below how many um, medication you're on. How many do you take every morning? You don't have to say what they are. That's personal information. I'm in a weird mood this morning. I'm really random this morning. It's 8.22. I had to film some Instagram stories. I'm doing an Instagram share week with some friends on the gram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, link down below. What's going on this week, y'all? <coughs> that got in my mouth. Ew, it does not taste good. Busy, productive week we have ahead of us. I'm challenging myself to work out five times this week. So we'll see if I do that. And then, oh, I want to read every night this week. Those are the things. So this is like, we can do a week in my life challenge. Reading every night before I go to bed and working out five times a week. I can do it. It's just like laziness gets the best of me. Let's try to do her morning tricks. I give her these little seasonal allergy things. Oh, it's hickory salmon flavored. I didn't realize that. Though so she like gets like red sometimes with the allergies and stuff. So I give her two of these and she loves them. They're just like treats so that we practice her morning tricks. Did I say the word treats? Did I say treats? Okay. Wanna show your new trick? Day. Leave it, leave it. Okay, you can take it. Oh, good girl. Okay, up, up. Good girl. That is a good baby. Hey guys. Whew. I left work early because my coworkers had to leave. They had to go do stuff and we have a rule like you're not allowed to like be in the office by yourself. I mean, I got off early. So I went to the gym and did 12, 3.30. Towards the end, I was feeling like a little weak and a little shaky. Was gonna do a leg workout after, but I was like, no, I don't feel the best. So I'll just do arms. And I like picked up the weights, like the arm weights. And I did like a few like bicep reps and I was like, uh-uh, this is not it. I need to listen to my body. So I'm gonna go home. I ate a lot today. Like, I don't understand why I'm like this. Typically this happens if like, I just don't eat enough protein. But I had barbecue chicken, so I don't know. I'm gonna eat this and drive home, pick up a package. Maybe we can unbox it. It's a really exciting package. I'm excited about it. I'm gonna take Kyla Girl to the park. She'll wanna go. So hopefully I feel better. I'm gonna drink some water and listen to your body, ladies. Hello friends, I have a little unboxing. See with some exciting things that I want to show you. I'm really excited about this. Okay, so Rifle Paper Company and Quirks Cool did a collab. And I got this little travel mug. I just thought it was so beautiful and the perfect size. And I've literally been thinking about it for so long. It says it keeps your stuff hot for three hours. I love quartz cold products and it's just so pretty. I'm so using this tomorrow. And then to get free shipping, I rifle paper company. Yeah, I spent $50 and this was 40. I'll link this down below because you all need it. It was an investment. I love it so, so much. And like, I rarely buy things this expensive. I found this headband that was $18. And I love headbands. Y'all know I wore one this morning. It's the same print, but it's like on a white. Ah, I'm so excited. It's so cute. I'll have this link down below as well. Oh, and then the other thing is also really exciting. So I found this girl on TikTok actually, and she has an Etsy shop. And this is like so sick. I think it, this is a hair scrunchie and I paid like $12 for it for a singular hair scrunchie, but it is well worth it. Well, first off, look at this cute little mailer. It's Haley from Ohio, and look at this. 
it's a scrunchie that she like designed with like the new Fearless Taylors version. So that's like her sketch of it. You've got a phone and 15, the I love you written on a notebook, all things from the Fearless album. And it's so incredibly beautiful. Like, how could I not get this? I'm so excited about this. And she just released like a headscarf too, but headscarves aren't really my thing. I think I'm gonna shower. I need to do some laundry. I need to do my reading. Cause I said I'm gonna read and I worked out. So woohoo. I feel so much better after I ate that half a gr granola bar on the way home. I don't know what that was. And now I'm like, I wanna work out more. So maybe I'll do a little workout or something. So I'll talk to you guys later. Good morning. I'm not in the mood for makeup today. It's lazy Tuesday. Okay. I am so not alive this morning, but here's my outfit. My favorite white button down. I haven't worn this in so long and it's quite wrinkly, but then just some jeans and some little slides. Going pretty casual today and I have no makeup on. My hair is disgusting, but it's just one of those days, you know? Here comes the princess. as I'm sitting here on the couch because I got ready so early because I did nothing to get ready. So yes, I worked out yesterday. You guys saw that I went to the gym. I also hurt my ankle <laughs> working out. So my ankle really, really hurts, but it's fine. We're gonna push through. Reading before I went to bed. I did not read because I was so tired, but I did do my Bible study last night. So I read a couple chapters of Revelation, which I think exceeds and is better than just reading my fiction book, you know? So I'm gonna say check check the box for both on Monday. And tonight will be probably difficult too because I have my small group tonight. So I was up to like 11.30 last night. So I need to go to bed at like 9.30 tonight. Comment down below what time you guys go to bed because I know I'm a grandma that goes to bed early. She, I swear she's a cat sometimes. This is her spot and she like watches out the window right there all day long. This is what she does when she's home. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go to work now. Hello, so I'm driving home from work but I have been so tired. I have been so unproductive all day today. It's been really bad. Like zero productivity has happened. I mean, like I did stuff obviously, but like I did not feel like I accomplished a lot, but I'm about to pick up a package that was delivered. I bought wedges from Target and like I never wear wedges. But that's the thing, like I have wedges, I just do not wear them. And so I really don't know why I bought them. So we'll see, maybe I'll return them. I'm gonna go for a run. I thought like I hurt my ankle yesterday, like while I was working out and it was like just throbbing all night. So going for a run is probably not my best option, but it's 75 degrees, it's really nice out. I have the time, maybe I'll just walk in listen to a podcast or just like take in nature and enjoy the time with Callie. My new mug was a smashing success today. It's so cute. Made me so happy every time I drink from it but I was drinking from it a lot because I was so tired and I've been so hungry today but like like I was yesterday but like I've eaten like a ton. I just like can't get enough. I don't know what it is but I really want chicken tenders. Oh my gosh. So I literally is just pulling up and there's like a lawn at the front of our apartment complex and I look over and this girl's like laying on her stomach with her like legs like Superman and her leggings are skin colored and I literally just thought she was butt naked and then I saw like her ankles were like tanner than her, le than her pants. Okay, 
let's go get this package and let, we can open it together real quick. Y'all, this package is massive. Okay, so they're universal thread. We love. Oh, they're really cute. I used to have a pair like this. They're like the old Mark Fisher ones. It's like this really cute and they've got like a braid and like a little square toe. Man, those are really cute. We'll reflect on this purchase and see where the Lord leads me. Okay. Let's go pick up Cali Girl. Drop it. Come on. So I'll day on the run. It's not going well for a variety of reasons. First off, instead of my ankle really hurting, it is my knee. My knee has been hurting while I've been working out. And part of me was like, just power through Elizabeth. But then I was scared that I won't be able to like work out the rest of the week, which is a really odd thought to come from my head. Cause I, I like working out and I want to work out the rest of the week, but I don't want to keep hurting my ankle and my knee. They're on the same leg. So I was like, we'll just walk it. I'll still get my exercise in, get my steps, you know, we're already here instead of turning it around. You know, like when dogs get a moving, they have to do their business. So Callie like pulls my arm into this yard to go poop. And like I have my baggies right here. And there's someone over there who's now watching me vlog. So there's that. Um, and the lady across the street, like on the other side of the yard, is in this other person's yard. And like Callie's pooping and I'm like getting my bag ready. Like I'm picking it up. And she goes, get that dog off of my property. And then continues to start being gross and like bat talking as she said, dirty dogs in there poop and their pee I don't want that anywhere as I've already picked up her poop every bit of it probably should have left some there I don't know who peed in that girl's cornflakes probably some ugly dog but that's how the run is going so we're not even halfway done yet Callie just laid down in the middle of our walk are you done we got we got another mile we gotta go Come on. Hurts. What? <coughs> it just has that dry. Oh. Hey, you mix with fire and blood. And you go. Hello, hello. I just got ready for work. We have like a big meeting today. Um, at one of our hotels. Like we're bringing people in. So I'm in my black high-waisted J. Crew factory skinny jeans, my little mules that I wear all the time, and this little top that I got forever ago. I actually wore this last week. I don't know if I was vlogging that day. For the meeting, I'm just gonna throw my new white blazer on top. So I can go to the gym after. I don't think I'm gonna go to spin because my knee and my ankle are still hurting. So I think I'm gonna do something low impact and do like the elliptical and then maybe like an app circuit or something like that um, and then jacob will be home tonight i think we're just gonna have like grilled chicken veggies okay well here's the fit let's get ready to go to work hello friends happy wednesday evening it's five o'clock and i'm leaving work today was a good day at work the meeting went really well today um the food was delicious except they had like polenta as like the grain and it was not good i've never had polenta before but it just like the texture was not it so but everything else else was so delicious. I mean, it's just nice to be treated to like a three course meal at lunch on a Wednesday, like a really big, beautiful salad. And then a very good grilled chicken breast, 
with some veggies and then the ones I don't eat. And then this like apple part for dessert, it was so good. And then I was in a food coma the rest of the day. Now we are headed home. Jake goes home tonight, so I'm really excited. We're just gonna like hang out and spend time with him. But I'm so excited because I got a PR package from Drunk Elephant that was delivered today. But yeah, so I'm like in a really good mood. I've been like so like giddy anxious all day because I want to go home and open it. Because like they are my favorite. I talk about them all the time. They've changed my skin and the fact that I get PR from them absolutely blows my mind. And they came out with a new product. So I'm thinking it's probably the new product. Honestly, I'm uh, I'm happy for them to send me anything. We're gonna do that uh, in my Sephora order was delivered. So we'll do a little unboxing. So many unboxings. Um, Jacob and I are gonna go for a walk and I'm gonna listen to Michelle Reed's podcast on the way home. That was seriously just so stressful to get these packages because my Sephora one was in the big locker. So like if they fill up all of like the individual ones there's like a really really massive one that they put all these random ones in and they just shove like there's probably like 60 packages that I just have to go through okay my samples I got the Tory Burch and the Way shampoo and conditioner but I got the Rare Beauty blush in Bliss see I've never tried Rare Beauty before this is the color I got. So pretty. This is so pretty. Can you see that? Very pretty. And then my eyeshadow palette. So this is the Tarte Lit Juicy Palette. And I have seriously had my eyes on this for so long. It just, it's so beautiful. And I rarely buy eyeshadow palettes. Like I have a ton, but like I rarely buy them because I do like BoxyCharm and stuff. Oh my gosh, I am so excited about this like the pinks and the neutrals and this massive mirror so that's what i got from the sephora sale now let's open the drunk elephant package sugared kiosk coffee skin softening blend powdered coffee beans brown sugar and cream oil so this is what it looks like when you open it oh my gosh little like travel mugs that's cute and then Sugared Coffee Almond Milk Scrub. I didn't know they had this. Awesome! That's so cute. I love a body scrub. Thank you, Drunk Elephant. I had no idea y'all had come out with this. So exciting. And a little travel mug. So cute. Thank you, Drunk Elephant, for sending this to me. You guys are the real MVP and my absolute favorite brand. So... I, I'm so happy. I cannot wait to shower. I did, I had no idea they came out with that product. I saw they came out with a new serum. I had not seen the body scrub. Now I have to carry all these <laughs> unboxed packages inside. Probably shouldn't have done that, but... Oh.